Welcome to Straight No Chaser's YouTube channel, and welcome to the club. We really appreciate you being here. If you haven't been here before, we just have two simple rules. Respect everybody's opinion, and allow everybody to speak. If you follow those two rules, we will get along just fine. If you haven't followed any of the mods in the club, please do at this time. Click the greenhouse at the top and join the club. If you violate those two rules, we will send you to Goo York City. Other than that, welcome to Straight No Chaser's. Let me get the pool tag. Right, I've been like thinking about big. all the homies lost in war in Chirac. So we about to play that audio real quick. Cause uh, yeah, thank you for the okay, submission, bro. creep. Bro. bro, yes. Can you add this account to the back channel, please? Uh, if this room, yes, yes, yes. I got you. Okay, so it's you know what I'm saying, folks? Like, niggas don't understand that. Niggas be playing these games, gang. Niggas ain't never lost. Niggas ain't really losing, niggas, gang. Folks, no, gang. I'm allowed to lost every nigga, gang. I'm tired of this shit, gang. For everybody that got something to say about what I was doing or crying and all that, check this out. I'm a grown man. Man, and if something touch me and my soul for my brothers, see you goofy ass niggas, that's what's wrong with the world. Y'all want to play tough and y'all too tough. Y'all scared to show emotion. Y'all bottle that shit. And then guess what happened? Y'all ain't no want to kill y'all self. One thing about King Yellow, this is the difference between me and these other niggas. I don't give a fuck what y'all got to say. I don't care how y'all feel. If I was hiding it, I wouldn't have posted it. Dumb ass. Guess what? I wasn't talking to myself. I wasn't. I was talking to somebody on the side of me. But I don't catch. I don't catch myself crying because I don't usually do it all the time. So guess what? I did it for the world <coughs> to show to y'all ain't nothing wrong with showing how y'all really feel or being yourself. Stop portraying and try to be gangster and tough for the world. That's why the world. That's why Chicago. That's why niggas study die. But you niggas, half you niggas really crying in the, in the inside. <laughs> Y'all in the house crying all the time, though. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no shame on my game. Let you listen, check it out now. Well, I'll be damned. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is King Yella out of Chirac balling over the fact that he's lost a lot of good homies. Now, I'm going to keep it real with y'all. This video is really meant to show the other side. Please don't take it any other type of way. Now, what do I mean by the other side? You know, for years in drill music, and this is one of the reasons that I was captivated about the, you know, the crime. And when I be captivated, I was shocked. I was like, I was in like, what the heck is this? Because I've never seen murder and violence just be so normalized where people were losing friends and people who had promising careers were getting gunned down and nobody cared. We didn't see people openly more. We didn't see people, you know, breaking down like you would normally see when people lose a loved one. Everybody just had this tough facade, okay? Instead, what would happen, people would just go do revenge killings or they would diss the dead of the other people they're beefing with. Nobody seemed to really have or process real grief, emotions. So when I see Kenyella do this, trust me, those tears, I don't think they're coming for the first time. I think they've always been here. But this is one of my problems with drill. Because all the rappers only show you being tough and being desensitized to murder. Nah, they break down. Yeah, they all do. They're they going through trauma. And I think this imagery is also important if y'all really want to tell the whole story. Y'all want to tell the story about y'all smoking on who and who and who. But you don't want to tell the story about the nights you cried. The nights you couldn't sleep. The pain you felt in your stomach when you realized your homie was dead. The homie that you was chilling with every day for the last five to ten years. That's not a complete story. And that's one of the things about drill music that makes it so one-sided. Okay, nobody talks about the bond hearings. Nobody talks about the, the times where their mother is disappointed. I mean, some artists do, but that don't get all the credit. We just like hearing the spilling and drilling and drilling. Nobody talks about not being able to hire a lawyer. Nobody talks about really the, the other side of the funerals where you got to go identify a body. Nobody wants to talk about being a pallbearer. Nobody want to do all that stuff, right? People want to talk about, yo, they caught somebody lacking. But this is a 360 view. You got to have this in the story if you gonna really tell it. And what King Yeller did on live is just kind of showing you that he's human too. 
I mean, a lot of these guys in Chicago, they, they, they call themselves savages. It made it easier to dehumanize them in the sense of, oh, they don't feel things the normal people would feel. They don't have the same emotions. They're numb to it. They're used to it. But who could get used to your homies dying all the time? Gun violence. Constantly feeling like war. And even though I hope that King Yellow's in a different place in his life, you could clearly see it's affected him. You know, I send, um, you know, my condolences to, you know, all of his fallen friends. And I also send my prayers for everybody who has been affected by drill music that hopefully they can get the help that they need. Because this is a lifelong effect. It's not only when the music was popping, right? Get in the comments, make sure you guys like them, subscribe. What do you think about this? King Yella, you know, he finally broke down and he misses some of his guys. Man, people be having a fucked up perspective about Chicago, and I'm uh, I'm tired about that shit, man. Motherfuckers die everywhere. But Tink, aren't they getting into him like that because he left Chicago and uh, went to Vegas? Hey, I'm not going to lie. Who we barely it? know that. Yeah, like, I'm not yeah, even going to lie. Yeah, who is like, Never this heard of this nigga. Yeah, like, that nigga's a I'm, bitch. I don't even, I don't even <laughs> heard about King Yellow coming on Clubhouse. I, and I'm from Chicago. I don't even know. Bro, that nigga said that nigga's a bitch. Y'all yeah. had to be following the drill movement back in 2012. You know who that nigga is. Yeah, I know who he is. He was a nigga ran. What's the name that passed? That's what he said. Real quick, one mic on Creek. No, I'm just saying that nigga's a bitch, bro. He went into hiding and all the way into Vegas, left Chicago running. Nigga, and then he broke down crying like a pussy on that goddamn, uh, on that live. You know what I'm saying? Talking about all this shit got to stop, all the violence got to stop, this and that, and then turn around and be the same nigga trying to extort somebody for some money. That, and, which mean, nigga, you in support of a nigga who created, who, uh, who committed a fucking violent act, nigga? So you ain't against violence in no form or fashion, my nigga. You a part of that shit. The fuck he just contradicted himself, dude is a bitch. Nigga crying like Arsenio in Harlem Chicago Nights when they killed his brother. People in Chicago did not listen to his music. He got oh, like trying to push that narrative. He got popular by talking about Dirk and them. Yeah, cause he teamed up with he teamed up with um Double O, Lil J, and all of them. Remember, he teamed up with FBG, so he was clouding up off of them niggas. Yeah, now he now he's running around doing Doing skits and shit, trying to be a funny guy. Like, yeah, I was knocking at his sister Bumpy up here in Sacramento. I had a sister in the car. Yeah, he he for sure got one up there. And then you got to remember, he only jumping in the blogging because billionaire Black is getting on with the blogging, telling all them stories because he out in Arizona. No, he did. He started it first, bro. Being but that shit ain't never went up. How, how, black. how billionaire shit was going up. I don't know who these niggas is. They talking about. <laughs> they they just just got the young, ran that young Chicago niggas that made it. They do this shit at least once a once a day on this motherfucker. Have me lost in the motherfucker talking about all these. Niggas. <laughs> what, these the niggas that never these the niggas that never reached the little dirk in them status you know what i'm saying yep. these the niggas who had hopes of being the little dirks before the little dirks coming out of chicago and, and never fucking made it the BTC team. when they didn't when they when they couldn't make it they ass ran the fuck up out the city because they was talking too much about the city business you know what i'm saying and they didn't get the clout that they was supposed to get off of it. So now they got to worry about bullets flying over their fucking head. So they left. And then they didn't pick up more beef because niggas like T Grizzly. And then they went and started over there with the old block niggas. So they dissing these niggas too. They got all kinds of shit going on over there. Hey, he, 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 he got out of prison. You're absolutely right, nigga. When I had his sister in the car, boy, she had got jumped yeah, all kind of shit. Exactly beat over all kind of nigga had everybody. Yeah, he meant to. He said four times. Yeah, you had his sister in the car. My nigga came yellow did. rolling around Vegas. Man, what you talking about? I'm on BMW. Hey, yeah. yo, Bumpy, 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 check your back channel. Any man who going through something, who take the time. Why they crying and all that shit? To pull their phone out? He ain't going through nothing. That's exactly what I was about to say. Bozo. That Videotaping bozo. yourself crying is bullshit. That nigga, you going through something, you crying and shit, and you going to go pull your phone out, go to the Instagram app, go on live, and, and record yourself crying? You's a goofy. Like, that shit don't work like that. 
But baby, this, we, but baby, is this all still roll into the fact of how they would they we seen this when we seen them niggas running the breeze up. It's the apologizing for crying part for me, nigga. That shit is out. Them niggas running the breeze up. Them niggas locked up like dope with motherfucking niggas. Them niggas started talking to that nigga. They was supposed to do something to him. Yeah, they got talking about hold on. Y'all talking when they was in the mall. They killed him. Yeah, and that nigga, and that nigga like six five, nigga. Yo, that's what I'm saying, bro. What's the whole breeze? Lucky we ain't do nothing, but they pulled up on him too deep, and Breezy was by himself, and they started talking to that man. No, but no, 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 no. Dude, dude, King Yellow didn't say nothing. He just looked, and it was the other dude talking, man. It was Billy there that was talking. Billy now, Billy. But they was supposed to get off. Hey, Bumpy, they was supposed to kill him. They ain't even... They enemies to the point to where a pack out ain't enough. They was really supposed to do Remember, this is, this is before Breezo went to, went to jail, so this nigga's getting his yeah. shit up right now. Bro, that nigga was up dissing them niggas. Yeah. That nigga can't yell as a bitch. Them so. That nigga, that nigga 600 Breezy was the Vaughn before Vaughn. He was Back. what? Nah, no, you can't say that. Come on, bro. What like you mean? If you was, you hold on, what what listen, 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 compare, don't like get smoked. Guy, compare, bro. don't get smoked. The crazy, the crazy story, bro. That's the same damn song, bro. Nah, whack. They ran. But into. I like Bre- what Breezy do. I like Six Nine nah, Breezy is. kicked that shit off with that song. Um. Don't get smoked back in the day. And, and he Breezy was had a Drake dog. cosign. Drake had cosign yeah. Breezy. At one yeah, time. and he had the Drake cosign. That's when he just called himself um, I, Ice I Durvin. But what he's saying though, whack is Breezy is the nigga. Uh, that's Ken Yella enemy. You feel me? And Ken Yella and another nigga ran into Breezy. I think was in the mall, and uh, they were supposed to get busy, and they didn't do shit. And then later on, they got online. And was talking about how they gave him a pass and they could have did this and could have did that. You know, all the shit could have would have shit. You know, Breezy I'm also the same nigga who confronted Charleston White while King Yellow and them making videos about Charleston White. They ain't doing shit. Yeah, Charleston White, didn't he call his P.O.? Last thing I heard about uh, this King Yellow dude is he got shot trying to do a Black Lives Matter music video. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's all I know. That That's nigga all about right. The That's only cold. reason Yellow was going up like that because he was hanging with Alpo son. When Alpo son was around Cardi B and them, mm. so they 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 had some type of status off of that. Shit. I forgot about the Cardi B shit. What the hell, Alpo son? Son, son? While, 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 while Alpo son was with, with paparazzi, po, paparazzi, po, uh, yeah, paparazzi, yo, po, this, so yo, yo, y'all hear all this shit? This why we don't take none of you young niggas. <laughs> Yeah, Al son somehow bring some type of something to this nigga. What the fuck? He How was Al Pacino? Five fuck years together. he did. They fuck with the GDs in Chicago, Cardi and um Pop when they was running together before Cardi got on like that. Mm, Cardi fuck with who fuck with her? Cardi's a Bronx female. Nigga that was stripping in the Bronx and hustling nigga YouTube. Yeah, yeah, but when Yellow was trying to spin the narrative, he was trying to say some way out crazy shit. He was he was he was fucking talking Cardi. Shit. He was trying to He act said like he, he was, was fucking Cardi. Cardi, that was his bitch before he got pictures and shit with him. Shit. Hey, well, hold on, that bro. What off, offset wasn't um dealing but with no, Cardi he was just shit. doing it to antagonize offset. offset. That's why he was saying the shit. Yeah, yeah way so before offset. Offset. Bro, Offset got five, six kids. I'm pretty sure Cardi B had other relationships before. Uh, uh, nigga, she she was well. Listen, I don't get. It, it ain't like uh, she was a virgin when she made. I him think. Shit. I yeah, think. See, I'm on the way. Y'all and us was. If it wasn't worth talking about, we didn't talk about it. Y'all niggas talk about everything. Oh yeah, it, y'all it, talk it, it wasn't worth Y'all give it. Y'all give it to the, the whatever y'all call this shit clout. I still ain't because clout is good and it's bad. I guess I don't know what the fuck, but cause some shit we ain't even. Wait, what happened? We got to move on that, or we say, oh man, that ain't our motherfucking business. That's their business. Y'all niggas talk about it, nigga. You seen the motherfucking whoop the whoop the whoop whoop? Y'all talk about everything. And then it's like a kitten garden story. By the time we get to the tip. Tip kid, nigga, it's a whole nother story. Y'all niggas crazy. <laughs> they ain't hey. making no noise in Chicago at all. They ain't hey, uh, so ki- so ki- um, King Yo, we got this link at the top. Uh, King Yella gets checked by WAC 100 and Memo 600 on death of a cloud chaser. Memo 600. 
Mm-hmm. Well, he's got to do it. Damn, he didn't insert it. His God damn. Nah, I mean, I was I was man. That got to be old. What the nah, this must be old. old. This got to be yeah, old. Right. Yeah, that's old. old. That's old. Hello, can y'all hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Oh, he was on y'all floor, Tink? Nah, remember Wax, you checked? Yeah, that's Hey, Wax, remember um when we was part of that block chase and you checked the shit out of him? Yeah, no, you checked the shit out of King Yellow when he came to the room. That was my first video ever. Did I put that? Let me play play that shit. Play that. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know who the nigga is. That was when you was crashing. So he been not liking me then. I get it. Okay. Yeah. Nigga, years before this, nigga, what? Nigga, I don't, man, I don't know blood, this, this nigga been talking shit for years, blood. I he, I ain't heard him, bro. I Remember can't that, hear sir. you. <laughs> when you was just crashing, what the fuck? Hey, can somebody run that? Who in here got the shit? Yeah, 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 yeah. DJ got it. DJ might got it. Man, Wack One Hundred then created a lot of. Opportunities on no, YouTube. It's too low. It's, it's too like, low. You got to turn uh, it up. Honey, YouTube channel that's based off of that nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? And niggas is eating off this shit for sure. So he, he be bringing some good to the game. He be, he be running. <laughs> Good shit, bro. He, he reached to the water. It's just up to you to drink the water because you the one thirsty. He's not thirsty. Big facts. Yeah, my boy's still off running, man. I'm trying to hit him. Hey, hold on. I'm going I'm to hit him on Instagram. Hold on, bro. I got his contact. Okay. My bad, y'all. Did somebody call me? That was the spirits that called you. Nobody checking for you. Okay. Damn. Are you cool? That was disrespectful, <laughs> like a mug, bro. bro don't, even don't even worry about it, bro. Chill out. Relax. It's good. Hey, fast forward Relax. a little bit. I don't want you to hold the Yeah. That same nigga that fuck all said, bitch. Tell me when to stop going, can you? I'm gonna keep going fast for and I ain't never You ain't gonna go back. Welcome to the clubhouse, bro. What y'all love right here, man? What they talking about, nigga? Dick Ryder? What's going on? Up there? Right, exactly. Go on here. There you go. Oh, go ahead, bro. Talk about something else. We ain't going to do that, bro. But look, exactly. man, uh, AC, nah, you set the room real quick. What's up, y'all? Welcome to Death of the Cloud Chaser. If you're new to Clubhouse or new to the space, all you gotta do is hit that greenhouse with the whole little middle up top, and make sure you go ahead and smash that motherfucker join club button, become a faithful member of Death of the Cloud Chaser. If you would like to come up, you definitely can, but please make sure you are following the, per- the club first. Make sure you give your moderators a good follow. Make sure you just follow everybody on the stage. Go through everybody's followers. Make sure everybody's up on that 1,000 followers. We all eat. Let's welcome King Yellow to clubhouse uh we got fbg sherman here as well we got some cool ass people in the building y'all so definitely give everybody a follow king yellow salute to you thank you for coming out and um talking with us it's all love it's all love hey, king, yo, hey bro like, like, let me start about like saying like welcome to clubhouse man everybody y'all follow me yo you know stay in the clubhouse as well as man welcome home bro good looking guy Shit, man, you free now, bro. Like, I know you've been going crazy on the music and shit. Like, what well, to that shit? Like, you 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 going? You signed or you still independent? I'm I'm independent. I ain't really thinking about no deal right now. I mean, like distribution and shit, but not no you real me. Not no more bugger controlling my life. That's out. No, I got you. And you, like, you know, I don't mean to go straight to it, but, like, um, we got him in the title, man, R.P. L.P.G. Duck. You know, you was incarcerated when he lost his life, man. Like, um, how you feel about that? You know, that fucked me up. That's my little brother. Yeah. Broke my heart, man. You know, that shit is kind of different now. You know? 
Yeah, man. Sorry for your loss, bro. R.P. Duck, King Yellow, this big snow talking. You know, I had a chance to meet Duck. I'm out here in Minneapolis. You know, we got kind of close out here, man. Uh, yeah, you yeah. know, we stay. We're going to come around in Minnesota. Yeah, you know, that's my nigga, man. You know, they, they live on my block. You know, they, they stay on my block out here, man. You know, I fuck with Big Sean. I'm a, you know, I just followed you right now on here. I'm going to tap right. in with you, bro. We get some shit. Get some shit going out here, man. Get you out here to the studio. You know what I'm saying? Then we're going to make something happen. I keep getting these phone calls. Hold on. No doubt. But, uh... Like, man, bro, like, when it comes down to it, like, you coming home and it's a whole bunch of shit being said about you, you know, on social media, like, is it different from back then to now? Well, it's like what? Like, like, uh, uh, like when people say certain things, like, now when you, you say something on Twitter, it, it's probably going to go viral right away. People going to uh, put their own caption on what your caption said. Uh, like, yeah. is it the same way back then as it is now? Uh, you know, the whole game done changed, man. There's a lot of funny shit going on with this shit now. Like, I don't know, you know, everything, man. You know, they taking everything what a nigga saying and putting their twist to it, you know what I'm saying? That's what they doing. Everybody, you know, trying to get the clout off shit. But in this era, though, you think, uh, like, like I know back in the day, it was a lot of blackball, y'all said, that was going on. And uh, you you think that you was blackball back then? But first off. Hell yeah, we was blackball. Probably still blackball right now. It's just, you know, certain niggas, man. You know, the other side, man. You know, niggas, niggas develop relationships with niggas, man. And, you know, once you develop a relationship with a nigga, you know, it's easy to get another, get a nigga cut off, you feel me? Don't allow these niggas in that dog, man. You feel me? And that's what niggas was doing with us. Oh, so, like, when they say that, like, you know, King Von, he pretty much used to be around FBG Duck. Like, was you around these old block members? No, I don't know the niggas. I don't know the niggas like that. I mean, I done, you know, I mostly look more, know, like, more OTF niggas than niggas from that side because... I'm from 73rd and 80, you feel me? Dog Pound and Dirk and them, 72nd and Green, like we all really from Inglewood, you feel me? Lamron and shit like that, you feel me? Old Block, uh, Duck and all them, they from off King Drive, back back that way, you feel me? That's a little strike down, you feel me? But, yeah. You see, y'all go check out King Yellow new video. It's called Missing Duck, man. King Yellow, what's good, my brother? You all right? And that video yeah, go hard. I'm highly man. Yeah, make sure y'all go watch that Missing Duck. I just dropped another video, too, called I Tweet with me and Duck. Then my next I dropped go it. Hard, well, yeah, um, I'm tweaking that go hard right there. I just finished listening to it. Yeah. Then I dropped, oh, I dropped the whole tape, that 13 joints on that bitch, Duck Ain't Dead. Niggas just working, man. I'm trying to stay out the way and get some money. Man. So them new, new, recently recorded songs, or you, like, um, uh, well, of course they is. You know, um, I forgot that uh, you just we just said that, um, well, well no, I tweaked, I tweaked, I, tweak, I actually recorded that 2018 before I got locked up. I just didn't put it out. Yeah, I'm just saying, you know, I tweaked that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, that shit was hard. We recorded that in 2018 before I went to jail. And uh, most of the song, most, majority of all the songs, it's probably like two, let me see, probably like two, three songs that I already have from like 2018 that I put on that. Then the rest all since I've been out. How you feel about like what's going on with Mama Duck and like with you know, FBG Duck music? You know what I'm saying? Uh, you you want to speak on it? What you mean? Like what the, what the label doing? <laughs> huh? Yeah, what the label doing? I mean, like, at the end, I mean, at the end of the day, it's like what the labels—they don't give a fuck about. They don't give a fuck about us. 
they just signed Doug because there was money coming. They don't give a they ain't give a fuck about him. So with the situation, what what they gonna do? Hand over the money and make sure he go to his mama? No, ain't no label gonna do that. Nobody gonna do that. That's why it's called royalties. And if you don't own your shit, they gonna take everything. Period. And then the royalties, you feel me? The masters, you don't own that shit. That's what happened when you sign a record deal. That's why niggas need to sign distribution deals where you own your shit, you own yourself. You don't become no motherfucking slave to these people. That's out. What's your current relationship with like FBZ? Like, does it, like, a lot of people say that it broke up. Like, does it still exist? And what's your relationship with it? We all gang. Everybody just, everybody, man, growth and development. <laughs> everybody just doing their own thing. Everybody, you feel me? I'm not, I'm in Las Vegas. You feel me? Building in Arizona. Niggas in certain, niggas is in different states. You feel me? Everybody, you know, but... It's still all love though, but shit, niggas ain't kids no more. We ain't hanging on the corner no more. So, you feel me? That's part of growth. That's anybody. If a nigga, if you just see a, a crowd of niggas together every day, man, niggas. Is that something you want to put in the past, or is still the same? You still feel the same way after coming uh, home? It's all good. I ain't never feel no type of way anyway. He felt some type of way, but. Okay, well that's enough of offset. Y'all can get up off offset now. Leave that. Oh, uh, here we go. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Offset. You know, Offset was tripping over the bitch. Yeah, but you sound like you suck a dick. I, 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 I
I think I believe you. Yeah. I, mean, I was I just letting know. them know. Oh, Either way, go though. Whatever. Like you are the label. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I don't know what I don't. But listen, bro, listen to me. I don't entertain dudes and nobody, and that's that's respectfully. You're nobody in any of my buildings. You're nobody that my situation. I, I don't. I don't even know you. I, I don't even know what the nigga look like. So, how you know what I got? I don't know. Let me ask you a question. Is is Mimo bigger than Blueface? <laughs> oh, no. Man, I, I, I kept oh, telling them. Hey, well, I just re up. Hey, just do Blueface good, though. I just oh, re up. Hey, listen. I just re up him for two more, so I don't know. Maybe I don't. <laughs> man, hey, don't forget the game, now. Niggas keep forgetting. I mean, I just re up him. He re up in this month too, so I man, keep forgetting that Wax started out with Ray J. Like, you know what I'm people just what's wrong with these man. niggas, man? Like, my, that's my point, man. That's why I got so frustrated. Like, y'all don't know what King that Yellow is. said. Wax ain't got no. Who is me more than Yellow though? Who is the Nothing. Uh, they don't get along, man. They, 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 they wait, 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 size. hold on, wait, wait, Chuck. They from Hot Boys. Hey, Wax, hey, that Chuck. right here, that page you talking about? That's Chuck. a fake page. Chuck, yeah. you reach, you reaching right now, Chuck. What you know, what nigga that I ah, nigga I speaking on? Come on, bro. Like what you That's doing? What I said, bro. That don't even no, make sense. I'm I'm thinking maybe King Yellow and Mimo on the on no, the same no. side. They know each other. No, maybe. not whatsoever. No, it ain't, it ain't. Look, when I asked him that question, pretty much he dude responded the way you responded. It. That question was oh, right. hey, around hey, and on my side. This King Yellow, King Yellow with the GD side. Uh, we can on, like, on, no, it's bigger than that. Oh. This one is on Chuck. Chuck on the bullshit. No, no, no. Listen, Mimo is trying to go around and Mimo like his side. King Yellow is trying to use his ops, yep. buzz, to get some attention. Come on, bro. Like, we're doing it. Bro. Don't let Mimo do it. Yo, bro, Chuck, that's Chuck, that's Chuck that's let Mimo live, bro. For real, why you even trying to do that? Let the nigga live, bro. Like, Chuck, do it to go find his own way. On some real shit, bro. Like, what you doing? Like, let Mimo live, bro. Like, Chuck, do it to go find his own way. Chuck, do it to go find his own way on some real shit, bro. If you a real Chicago nigga, let the nigga live. Because all you going to do is get a nigga killed, bro. Yeah, he like don't this. have his own way, Wack. All he do is... No, but I'm saying, up. like, Chuck, what if Mimo get hot at the nigga playing with... You know what I'm saying? Like, what no, you doing, bro, bro, like, nigga? I'm just being what, real, what they bro. Got, listen, bro, whatever they got... Bro, I'm not from Chicago. Yeah, you, that's that's what I'm city. telling you. I'm telling you. I'm and I know Chicago, you preach hey, a lot of Chicago. And whatever they got going on, going on. But when he, yellow when ain't gotta be like that But what, what I'm saying is Chuck Don't promote the bullshit And have these niggas crashing out Like you don't, I mean you say you preach peace And you know all that I'm just saying bro Like I'm just thinking Are you telling me that these two niggas don't even get along So why would you even do that To where Mimo might start feeling some kind of way And like yo nigga fuck this nigga And then that shit going on bro Like dudes trying to use dudes name Because it's some chatter body to be relevant, and you know that, bro. But you from Chicago, that's your city. You know yeah, I mean? like I said, that's already been going on. So, like, when he said, when he answered that question the way he answered, whether I put it down or not, but how could somebody ask him a question about Mimo's business? That's where the problem came in. He said, Why would you ask somebody a question about Mimo's business? That's what the people want to know. Nah, man, that's not good. That's what the people want to know. How you feel about it? Hey Chuck, you got a solid foundation, bro, and you a very intelligent person. There got Mimo right there. Come on, yeah, that shit don't even make sense. Hey, what? So twist. Hey, 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 hey. Now y'all ain't got no room with this man anymore. Like, look who y'all talking about, this, though, man. bro. This a motherfucker who can't even come back to my city, man. Oh, got that so, ass. What I'm saying. Come on, man. It's me. Come on, man. Take that name out the bio, though. This ain't even no conversation for whack to be having, wasting no time to even be clouding up no lame yeah, ass like, nigga like him, bro. So you yeah. shouldn't even be saying his name. You supposed to call me and have me clear this up. This is a goofy. Yeah, you tweaking. You supposed yeah, to call. Out that this, you you supposed to call me with this one. No, nah, this nigga lying. I ain't no like. He, he not even nobody not to get along with. I'm not a tool. I'm not. He just a like, lying. Guy. This ain't. Yeah, yeah. Y'all tweaking with this. Out my way. And this, y'all tripping. That shit was just some shit for that nigga to come in here and get some. Yeah, he paid. He paid one of y'all to do some Hello? shit. He paid one of y'all to do some shit. <laughs> and y'all started this one. Yeah, who that is, though? Lame, man. Y'all tripping, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 
Well, this is the real Nemo phone in this bitch. Well, let's take kick him. <laughs> no, y'all tripping though, man. That name ain't even nobody to even be wasting y'all breath on. Especially for bro, y'all shouldn't even invite a bro to nobody like this, man. Y'all tripping. This is a good for and y'all know that some of y'all, some of y'all just want to see some hey, shit happen. Hey, we know your ass, man. Man, y'all got a fan tato page, man. Let me move you to the audience. See, y'all got all type of goofy shit going on. Well, that's the real tato. I ain't no fucking tato. Tato got my number, man. What is wrong? Who is you? Nah, that's really, that's really tato, Mimo. That's not tato, folks. Let me see some y'all in this bitch fan though, folks. Why did you lie to these people? Why did your number? I would have called you, folks. Stop playing with me, folks. He just got on the phone. Folks, I'm in this club and all shit, taking this shit, goddammit. Yeah, crazy. Tato, link your Instagram. Look, this is how you do it, bro. You go on and click on your uh, up top. Hey, boy. Folks say K. My dear brother, that's not him. He said everybody keep calling him saying that. Matter of fact, let me remove you from the room. Hey, bring that's... him back up. Bring him back up. Well, I'm gone. Y'all bring it up, fam. Wow, that ain't the real That ain't the real him. That is Tato. Oh, my brother, that's not him. Who is that saying that? Yo, hey, 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 y'all mad a little bit in this room. That's not no fucking Tato, bro. Oh, my kids, that's not Tato, bro. No, that, that's Nooski that said it is him. Nooski, he from the city, too. What city, Nooski? He ain't no from no fucking city. The suburbs well, ain't the city. <laughs> man, come on, man. Bring him, bring him up. Ask that's, him who he is. Bro, do you know who you talking to, bro? Do you know who you talking to? I'm finna show you. Matter of fact, let me FaceTime folks. I'm it. That's funny because if they didn't, if that's not the real Tato, they gave that nigga a bean. Yeah. Oh, me, my Hey, Tato. These people, bro. You know you a bitch ass nigga, bro. On BD, bro. Your ass sitting on this motherfucker app around to these people, bro. What the fuck is wrong with you, bro? Hey, Tato. All you gotta do, bro, link your Instagram to the page. Then we Post don't know. Bitch on BD. Post the bitch. You broke as hell. Your ass got dropped. Hey, don't kick them. Shit. Let them talk. Let them say whatever they gotta say, bro. Hash they shit out. Hey, Tato, that's if you yeah, really just Tato, no bad blood in the air. Yeah, ain't no bad blood in there. Your IG, your ID. You ain't never did nothing. Hey, Tato, 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 Tato,
Man, little bro just said he was on the FaceTime with him, bro. Like, look at my picture on my kids. He got, he got on the picture, Khaled. Look at his picture. On my kids, I just we oh, laughed at this clown ass. Nick, 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 Nick is a swing up and down, down on their mama. That was. Hey, tell him to say something. Bring the paper back. Man, we're not doing that goofy ass nah, shit, dude. He, 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 nah, they man. Just, hey, bring Lil Bernie up. Bring, what matter of fact? Bring, bring Young Mackie up. That's uh, Wax DJ. Y'all and this bitch fanned out like some straight little mamas on my <laughs> What the fuck going on here? Folks, yeah, he, he about to bring the real, the real bring, thing. Uh, some some uh, goof-ass nigga in here acting like he Tato Wolf and this shit. They and this bitch no following for it. that fake Tato page? I just FaceTime folks and PTO Tato. Yeah, 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 Tato. Thank you for watching the video. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click like, subscribe to the video, and follow us on all social media platforms. Come back daily to see new content or shit we throw up just to keep your day going. Remember, we put out nothing but premium content. The one, the only. Straight No Chasers.